weeks in a row. Do they? Let's break it down. Oh, wow, you know, it's pretty whammy. Garrett, not afraid to go against either of those hands. Can this be the time Garrett gets lucky on the flop? No, 9-5, deuce. Moosen out in front with two threes. Vince, could he win five out of five all-ins in this heads-up battle? Let's go, Come on. starting to shake his head. Needs to get lucky, but it's not going to happen as a jack of spades appears. And Moosen to look and see if he had a spade. He does it. Neither player has one. Garrett Greer must catch an ace or a king on the river to win this pot. Can he do it? He's had no luck so far in these all-in situations yet. Last card coming up. Here it is. No, it's a deuce of diamonds. Mosin Charania has done it again, Vince. Well, Vince, I got to say, Gary Greer has been about as unlucky in this heads-up battle as anybody I've seen in a long time. He was a big favorite in two all-in occasions. What a turnaround we are seeing. Mosin Sharania now a big chip leader. He is ever so close to becoming a two-time WPT champion. Stay with us. We're coming back for more on the World Poker Tour. Just so close. Bellagio special to me because this is where I won the five diamond in 2006 and I come back every year for it. Playing poker in Vegas, you just automatically come to the Bellagio. You don't go look for games anywhere else because we know all the best games are here, all the big names are here to play as well. So whatever your stake is, whether it's one, two or 500,000, it's here. You just don't even think about anywhere else to go. You just come straight here. Very talented Joe Hashem, always entertaining. But right now, the heads up battle here continues. And what a turnaround. Motion Sharania now, he's got 16.5 million. Garrett Greer now down to a million. Motion with Queen Eight. He's going to push Garrett in. I, don't, I can't go, I just got to go. Garrett calls him. Come on, GG. Come on, Garrett. Come on, Good one? Call it, Garrett. Garrett must win this pot to stay alive. And even then, he's on the extreme short stack, but has the best hand once again. Hasn't won in a heads up, all in confrontation with the best hand or the worst hand. And we are a flopping, and Garrett hits the tens as a 10 7 deuce appears. Finally, some justice. Coming to the turn. Four of diamonds, safe for Garrett. Lucky lady. We're down to the river. Mosin must catch a queen to end this tournament right here, right now. Mosin couldn't be that cruel to hit the queen now. If he does so, he's, you know, he's not going to do it. Eight of hearts. Let's go, GG. So Garrett Greer going to double up. You know how much I like to get it in with the worst hand, so it's not over. <laughs> and Garrett still managing to be a good sport. Well, Vince, he's really done not much wrong. He just hadn't been lucky. Anybody that can smile now after what he's going through at this final table, you got to take your hat off to him. He lays down the 5-3. Oh, how do you fade it? Here he gets a little lucky because Mosin has a pair of kings. And Gary quickly folded wow. with the nothing hand. Reads on point. One more time. Man picks up two kings at the final table here on the World Poker Tour of a televised event. And DraftKings puts $1,000 into his DraftKings account. Well, not only will they hook Mosin up with $1,000, but DraftKings also sent 13 qualifiers here to play at Bellagio. My name is Brian Mikon, and I won my seat on DraftKings. My name is Sebastian Brown, and I won my seat on DraftKings. My name is Kyle Johnson, and I won my seat on DraftKings. I'm just a farmer rancher from North Dakota. I just got into it. I seen they were giving the seat away for a chance to play poker, and I like to play poker. The $55 satellite gives me an opportunity to play in a tournament I don't have to bankroll to buy into, so it's a really great opportunity. Many of our players are very interested in poker, so when we partner with the World Poker Tour, in this event we have 13 people that qualify through playing DraftKings. I've seen a lot of poker players get into Daily Fantasy and have a lot of success, so if you're out there playing poker, I think this is one of the best things for you. This guy won a million dollars. Uh, just to go head to head, with some of these guys and beat them on a pot is like a, that's 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 a bucket list event right there. I love the atmosphere. I'm having a blast. Uh, I, I can't believe it. two dollars. You know, I have the chance to win millions of dollars. It's a wonderful story. Drafting.
Yeah, uh, just a great sponsor. Sending that many players to a 10K buy-in. Terrific. Ocean Sharani well out in front with over 16 million in chips. Garrett Creer just about has to go all in on about anything, with blinds being 150 and 300,000. All in. He's got a pair of deuces, says all in. How much is it? 1.45. Call. And Mosin with a 9-6 is going to give action to Garrett. And he's in a race. Race. About the best he can hope for. Here we go with the flop. It's a queen 10 8. What kind of flop is that? Come on. Okay, so Garrett's still in front, but a lot of openings for Mosin with his straight draws. He's got a two way straight draw. Seven or Jack would give him a straight, six or nine would give him the lead. If the board pairs twice, he would also win. Four of hearts. Garrett's still in front. So Garrett, a good favorite going to the river. Can the Ducks hold up? Bartender, shot a jack. Uh, six, seven, nine, or jack is what he needs to win. Can Motion make it happen right now? He's done it! He's hit the jack! He's made the straight on the river to take down his second WPT title. He played really well. Now we go party. You've got to feel heartbreak for Garrett Greer. He played his heart out tonight. Congrats, Motion. I was dying. Oh, Congratulations right. to our two-time WPT champion, Mosin Charania. But before we talk to him, let's talk to our runner-up, Garrett Greer. I obviously had an overwhelming chip lead, and, and Mosin had to get lucky a couple times. And I'm obviously super stoked, but I mean, I wanted the title. But if it has to go to somebody, obviously, Mosin, he, he would be my first choice. So I'm happy for him, but I, it still stings a little bit. And now let's talk to the champion of the Five Diamond World Poker Classic from Chicago, Illinois, Mosin Charania. <laughs> Mosin, with this win tonight, you're doing an elite group of multiple winners out here on the World Poker Tour. Tell us how you're feeling right now. Uh, right now, I'm still trying to kind of soak it all in, but uh, being a two-time champion feels pretty damn good. I feel like I played pretty well and got really lucky when I needed to, so... As long as that happens, you'll win another WPT. <laughs> well, in addition to nearly 1.5 million in cash and entry into the WPT World Championship at the end of the season, you also get a diamond on your name on the WPT Champions Cup, indicating a two-time champion, as well as a 24K monster set of headphones and a beautiful Ublo watch to commemorate your victory. Congratulations to our champion, Mosin Charani. <laughs> Lynn, back to you. What a sensational comeback by Mosin Charania, the season 13 Five Diamond World Poker Classic Champion. For Mike Sexton, Vince Van Patten, Tony Dunst, the Royal Flush Girls and everyone at the World Poker Tour, I'm Lynn Gilmartin. See you next time on the WPT. Sandwiches are full here. <laughs>